Okay, I'm just about to leave to Leicester to the museum because they yeah, got a Star Wars exhi exhibit there. Some guy like put all like his Star Wars collectibles in that museum. So I'm gonna check it out. As you can see, I'm dressed for the occasion. So yet, go. I've just arrived in Leicester on our way to the museum to see some guys Star Wars um, collection well sort of in mostly all toys and posters but we will see that on our current video up to come and there is the museum just away we go as you see we've got both there and Storm Tree built there so now we are going through the entrance it is pretty um, exciting to say the least I mean all the stuff that we're there is sort of really um, unique and different just like this um, spaceship with all the figurines inside that is something I've never seen before and it looks pretty um, cool I mean I like how this um, looks and the figurines are definitely um, genuine but of course I have that one taking stuff out of the packaging do use the value but never the same it's pretty cool what kind of collection he has I mean the figurines do look pretty cool and you look like the sort of expensive stuff. So I felt that we um, we um, cost him a lot of money and I have no idea why he um, offered it to the museum for a short amount of time because I bet his house is now so bare unless he had them all in filming um, boxes for some reason but then even he had like newspaper articles even about toys even got your diagram baby on the deposit and your video I don't know if that him or someone who's talking about it I even got wall art I mean how on earth can you um Take that off your wall and put in the museum. So that must be like sort of sort of thing he bought for the museum or something. I have no idea. If you have any ideas about this whole thing, let me know. But I quite like the look of that figure though. You're pretty um creepy. And even got there for charity. And that is really cool. Um, that is definitely a picture for my to show the video and this Darth Vader helmet were pretty awesome to say the least and you even got to a nice screenshot spot inside the movie as well I mean it's been a long time since I've seen the Star Wars movie so it a bit phasey but that um, Millennium Falcon I think it is it's pretty awesome and he has so many um, toys I, I, I am really interested in how this came about to be in the museum I am um, we am um, I mean, this would be really um, hard thinking to display everything like that. Just small, um, I think they're called cool, like Titan figures or something. And I really do like these wall pictures, they are pretty um, awesome. And that is definitely one of the best ones in the exhibit. I just had to take a selfie with it with Stormtroopers. Of course, 
since I like posters, the best thing probably around is the movie posters. Even got a couple of movie posters like from foreign countries as well. That is pretty unique. I think I showed a video on that what coming up. But um, as I noticed when I was at the museum, all that they have is um, scenes. Now that was sort of a cool shot. But as I was saying, um, all what they have is just episode four, five, and six. They don't have anything from the prequel or the sequel to the prequel or the sequel series. Just the original three movies I mean that is really cool some drawings I couldn't get better up because there were people there but it got a load of really awesome drawings and there the posters from the different countries and even got I don't know how he obtained that the cinema viewing of it I quite like these figures with the um, coins or Pendants or something. They are pretty uh, neat. And as the day finishes, it only was a short trip, but time to leave the museum. So I hope you guys had fun by watching this video, and I'll see you for the next one. Bye.